Hello everyone and welcome to an unboxing of Rune Wars Command models for the Latari Elves uh, Yeah, it's in German on the box but it has uh, English cards as well It is from a Fantasy Flight Defunct range and I'm planning on using them for a The Old World Wood Elf So they're gonna be on 25mm square bases and not on the round bases they're del delivered with um, They just look awesome As you can see, uh, well, on the picture at least, painted up so, got the standard bearer at the side. Come on, dude. They come with one of those bases and cards and everything, but uh, I won't be using them. But uh, what we will get here is a hero, a standard bearer, a musician, and a uh, wizard. So, that's gonna be a spell singer. I'm gonna have a lord for my forces and a battle standard bearer, and the musician will go in an archer unit. Uh, Archer unit which I will be unboxing in a next video um, because I found a source where I can have these boxes for uh, slightly over 10 euros so uh, I bought the commands for uh, my characters in my army and I am going to buy uh, two or three more of the Archer uh, boxes well for uh, Archer units because uh, in the old world without, uh, they require their Archer unit as a core and uh, well you can have um, Units starting from 5, so yeah, if these models look a bit decent, uh, I did the elementals uh, in the past and they looked great for a tree kin, uh, so that's how the box looks on the inside, uh, a lot of cardboard and uh, here. Then uh, I'm going to use these models as a cheap alternative to uh, well, build my forces. So the box can go at the side. Cardboard inlets, lots of uh, things everywhere. Not the most handiest of packing, but uh, there we go. This goes to the old paper. Be back in a moment. Voila, and let's have a look. So, first thing we have here are uh, proof of purchase uh, tokens. So, okay. <laughs> Nothing I can do with. Then we have for the game itself the cards. Uh, both in German and in um, English. Uh, I'm not gonna use these ones because I'm not playing the Rune Wars game, so that's gonna side as well. Then the uh, German version of the instructions and the English version of the instructions. So here we see how to assemble the figures, then a bit of their background. Uh, that they are more skilled and disciplined than any other army and everything. But yeah, well, they're elves. The tokens, by the way, are overgrowth tokens. No idea what that's about, but it's for the game itself. So yeah, that's probably gonna end up uh, pulling all the tokens uh, in one lot and put them on Vinted or something for a Euro. That's uh, the movement tray for the unit. Uh, don't really need that one. And then we have the good stuff. The figures, which are... Uh, actually already assembled so why they put a... oh no they're not assembled okay the figures are made in a a hard plastic I'm gonna take one of these so a hard plastic uh, well a bit bendable it's a good quality they have a nice scale it seems so let's uh, put them together a bit on a careful side and push them in too much because I'm gonna glue them the reason I'm unboxing this is uh, I'm gonna use one of them uh, already gonna be next on the painting list and then the first problem comes they are molded onto the base damn didn't know that one so either I'm gonna cut off the base or I'm gonna put the base onto a 25 millimeter square and then uh, assemble it that way okay so I didn't know this that they were molded onto the bases but yeah that's uh, nothing you can't work about uh, with a clipper tick tick off goes uh, the figure of the base and uh, rebase it Easy peasy job, so that's not a not a big issue. But that's uh, the wizard, uh, the wizard figure. Still in doubt which one I'm gonna paint first. It's gonna be either the hero or the wizard. One of them will be the first uh, model for my army that I'm gonna paint up. So uh, yeah, put it in the comments. Which one would you like to see uh, finished first, the wizard or the hero, the battle standard bearer? He will be. Uh, not amongst the first because that's uh, gonna require quite some extension nice fit so uh, everything so he's a pretty awesome model though uh, great detail hope you can see it uh, put it in focus nice sculpted banner and everything so yeah th this is an awesome model I'm gonna enjoy painting that one boink there goes his arm again 
as I said, I'm gonna glue it all together. And then finally we have, how do we put this one together? Uh, like this, the roll out one piece. Uh, mm, okay, like this. So this one definitely needs to be glued, because otherwise there's no way it's gonna be stuck decently. Because that goes in that peg. And that goes in this peg. There we go. So that's a musician. I can uh, use it as a unit musician or something. Uh, maybe find some other use for it, but uh, yeah. It's uh, the least needed model of this set that I have, so uh, let's focus them in a bit more. There we go. Up. Let's put the arm back on for the group picture. Oh man. Sometimes I'm such a klutz. As you can see from almost all my unboxing videos, not only sometimes I'm just a klutz. But yep, yeah, there they are. The command group of the Lantari Elves from the Fantasy Flight Room Wars range and uh well uh, i think in the end i paid 11 euros 57 for the unit so great value and uh yeah this is gonna be a fun thing to paint up thanks for watching and see you back next time bye bye because then it will be the archers